Good morning, everybody. Uh, my name is Dr. Dietrich Klinghardt. I'm a medical doctor. I practice both in Europe and in Washington State in the U.S. Um, welcome uh, to our meeting today. Uh, we're in England and I was asked to introduce the audience, it's just a few doctors here, um, to the correct use of the biologically clean products that I use for most of my work. Um, it's a company in Seattle that has formatted, uh, designed their products according to my lectures. I have to say I'm not financially involved with the company, uh, but I like the product. Yeah, so this is biopureus.com is a website. Um, in my daily work with patients, we've come to know that really f almost all the chronic illnesses that we're facing right now, that's the neurological illnesses, Parkinson, MS, Lyme disease, um, but also especially the illness of childhood, autism, learning disorders, hyperactivity, brain tumors, are all linked to one single factor, and that is the pollution of our environment. And it's important to know that our body is always in an osmotic, balanced uh, exchange with the environment. And so when the environment gets toxic, we get toxic. And as the body accumulates toxins, um, we lose control over the microbes that are settling in our body. And so uh, we're facing a whole new host of uh, illnesses caused by parasites and by microbes, uh, Lyme disease just being one of the many. By the way, you know, I've been in medical practice now 40 years. I've been doing this work for about 30 or 35 years, so we have quite a considerable amount of experience. So I'd like to talk a little bit about some of the, the darker things of our time. Um, we've been using a, a special, very aggressive detox method in Germany uh, called apheresis. It's basically, it's a treatment similar to dialysis where the entire volume of the blood is taken out from one arm, put through a filter system and put back into the other arm. It's about a three hour procedure. And what we discovered there is that pretty much every American that we sent there um, is full to the ceiling with nanonized aluminum and with organophosphates, you know, Roundup being the number one place. And uh, the interesting thing is there isn't a single lab in the U.S. who can make this diagnosis. Why that is, I don't want to discuss yet. It's, it's not my, my place to, uh, to judge that, but it doesn't, you know, the aluminum toxicity didn't show up in the hair analysis. It did not show up in the different challenge tests that we do but it's every one of our patients is now way over 100, has been uh, dramatically uh, toxic with aluminum. And uh, just to, to give you a number, so on average, the aluminum amount in the blood, the toxic aluminum amount, is by the factor of more than 100 times higher than lead or mercury or cadmium or the other things that are discussed in our, our uh, literature. And, uh, it's very clear that uh, the, the source of the aluminum is the weather modification uh, program you know, that has been sprayed on the skies uh, by planes uh, with the intent to cool down the planet. But you know what goes up must come down and we're inhaling it. Uh, lung diseases are hugely on the increase in spite of the stopping of smoking uh, because of it. And so we looked into that, you know, how to get the stuff out and there was a strange synergism between Roundup, uh, you know, uh, the you know, main ingredient is glyphosate, um, and aluminum. And as it turns out, uh, Roundup acts as a chelator for minerals. So when we expose to, to eating non-organic food, the Roundup that's sprayed on it binds the trace minerals of this very food. <laughs> and prevents it from being absorbed. So most of us get trace mineral deficient uh, over time, uh, even when we eat organic. You know, it's, it's always like, well, there is no such thing as really truly organic and clean. 
uh, because the air moves, the rain moves, uh, everything kind of gets mingled up. And so uh, Roundup has the unfortunate property when it binds with aluminum, it transports the aluminum deep into the brain and the central nervous system. Um, this is not my research, this is more serious people than, than me that found that. And so we, what I want to focus on is that we cannot differentiate the detoxing a patient for aluminum uh, and detoxing from Roundup, they, they go together. And so we looked in the literature, there's been a lot published uh, about organophosphates, Roundup being one of them, or glyphosate being one of them. And I, I take you through that. So the things in the German literature is the humic acid from, from you know, the, the lakes and high mountains, the moors, the, the black stuff in there that's full of humic acid and fulvic acid. And a concentrate of that uh, is this product called Matrix Minerals. And that has been found to be very, very effective in clearing Roundup from the human body. That's published, it's not my idea. And so the second thing that is true for all organophosphates is there are certain plant adaptogens that are found in certain berries um, that are very, very effective in turning on the enzymes that clear the stuff from our system. And uh, amongst those are acai, it's a, it's a berry from Brazil, uh, plums, the, the western plum is high in antioxidants that achieve this target, pomegranate is in there, and the last one, last kit on the block, is the vitamin C from rosehip is set uh, in some research papers, over 200 times more effective as a acting act bioactive vitamin C as ascorbic acid. And so we put those two things together. One product is called Deep Purple that contains the pomegranate, the plums, and the acai. And then the rose hip uh, with this incredible cocktail of plant adaptogens that clear the stuff. And so our detox for Roundup is these three things. Um, it's a pleasant, these two things make a pleasant smoothie. Um, good tasting, at least you know, for me, good tasting. Uh, the Matrix Minerals, it's about an ounce to two ounces a day. Uh, it's very easy to take, uh, doesn't taste uh, nasty. And then when we go to the aluminum, there's two things that stand out. Well, there is several things that clear aluminum from the body. One is simply citric acid, lemon juice. You know, make a water bottle, put a lemon in there. Uh, and drink it throughout the day, that does clear some aluminum from the system. But the, the most effective clearly is the cilantro. And so I mentioned it before, two dropper full, three times a day of cilantro tincture goes a long way. BioPure has an electrolyte enhanced wildcrafted cilantro, which is my preferred product for this. Um, but the taste, again, for children, they take better to the pure alcoholic tincture, which is this big bottle here. Um, the other, so it's citric acid, it's cilantro, uh, and, and then the main ingredient that is listed in all the research papers is silica. And the main source of silica, of bioavailable, a uh, small particle sized silica that can go after the aluminum in the body is in horsetail tea. And so I know BioPure will carry a horsetail tea that uh, don't currently carry it, but it's fairly easy to find in the health food stores or to Google and uh, to find to source it on the internet. Um, I do not recommend to take any of the synthetic silica products that are on the market right now. Um, they just simply don't work. They don't go after the aluminum uh, in the system. And so this combination of cilantro, silica from horsetail tea, those two powders and the matrix minerals really addresses this fundamental issue that is killing all of us. You know, we're, we're all being poisoned with this stuff. And so um, this is the way out of it. And However, in order to make this work, we still need the binders on board. When we keep that all in mind, that these things work together, um, then we can get a wonderful, wonderful result. 